What's going on, guys? How you guys doing tonight? What are we making? All right, uh, the top of my list today, gentlemen and ladies, is um, I really like the idea of making a stormtrooper profile, but I'm open to listening to your guys' ideas. So, uh, so hit me with what you got. Yo, Nine Lives, what's up, man? Yeet Foil, welcome to the stream. <clears throat> yeah, you like Stormtrooper? Stormtrooper might happen. That might happen today. Stormtrooper, that's two votes for Stormtrooper. Three votes for Stormtrooper. Do the ripple function as the blaster. Ooh, like in a line? That's a good idea, actually. I have a really good idea for the ripple function, actually. We're going to have a really good ripple with this one. Squidward says, I have a green setup. I was wondering if you have any good green profile ideas. Um, Ideas for making them? Hmm. I do have like there's a matrix profile that I have that's green. That one's pretty good. Um I don't know, you just gotta check out. I've made so many. Um a lot of the green ones that come to mind. You just have to check out my channel, man. Yeah, a red ripple. I'm thinking a uh okay. For the ripple on a stormtrooper profile, guys, I'm thinking I'm thinking uh, a horizontal ripple, kind of like on the Booga profile, but every other line is either red or green. Do I have any streamer profiles apart from Mongrel and Booga? I have a Dr. Disrespect profile. And I have an Aiden profile. I have a couple streaming profiles. <clears throat> what's up essence how's it going man welcome back welcome back week number two week number two all right guys we're uh we're thinking we're thinking stormtrooper so uh let's take a look let's take a look at some ideas my mistake my mistake wrong scene all right stormtrooper I don't think we can get the whole details of the face, but we could definitely do like the eyes. That would definitely work. We could we could add add some nice wave pattern. We could definitely do the eyes, maybe maybe make the mouth work. If we do a head. Oh, by the way, I'm Mincy from Discord. Okay, cool. Yeah, I got that. The one that showcased the mongrel lighting. Which one? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Right, yeah. Thanks for showing off my profile, man. I appreciate that. Maybe make a gun that blasts a red laser when you press a key or something. Yeah, I was thinking about that. I was thinking about that. I actually have that. I have that type of feature with my Fortnite blue pump. The, the blue pump. Um, yo, Adam Lewis, thank you for the sub, man. I appreciate that. My Fortnite blue pump design actually has that feature where um, it has a shooting animation when you click your mouse. Are you going to release this to everyone? Yes, Squidward. Um, if you look in the description, there's a link to my Discord. As soon as I'm done making the profile, it will go on my live channel on my Discord server. <clears throat> okay, I think uh, I think Stormtrooper wins it. 
I think I think uh, everybody kind of likes that idea. So that's what we're going to go with. We're going to go with Stormtrooper. All right. So we're going to add a new profile, guys. Add a profile. Um, I'm going to just save that previous one just in case. Can you guys hear my voice all right? Is it is it loud enough for you guys? What is that one you were on at sick? The one I was on <laughs> is actually a little bit of a teaser. You guys aren't supposed to see that. Uh, it's not going to be released to the public, unfortunately, for you guys. Um, this is one of my members only profile profiles. It is um, it is my Starry Night profile. So like the Vincent Van Gogh uh, painting. It's a uh, Starry Night. This is released only for my members. It's it's one of my members only profiles. Sorry guys, I did not mean to show you guys that. Although it is a good little segue into uh you're banned from our Discord. Oh, this isn't this isn't um the Chroma Profiles Discord. This is the Unreal Hero Discord. It's a different Discord channel. Different Discord channel. How do you become a member? Um, I think underneath the video it says join. It says join. <clears throat> and there's lots of cool different features in there. Um, there's different levels of members. So um, you guys can feel free to check that out. But um, I do have members only profiles in there. Uh, so far I just have um, a Guitar Hero one for you guys. And I have a Starry Night. But I release a new one every Tuesday. Every Tuesday. <clears throat> hey schools welcome to the stream what's going on man we're actually um we're not going to do the apex one this time i may do a video on an apex one maybe this week but uh this live stream is going to be for stormtrooper we're going to do a stormtrooper one the link to do it should be underneath the video i believe so if you look underneath my video um Oh, let me pause that. Yeah, there should be a join button underneath my stream video where you can join. <clears throat> All right, guys, we're going to get started with the Stormtrooper profile. So uh, click the three dots and we're going to add a brand new profile. Uh, what key do you press for the pump to shoot? I think it's only set up on a mouse. So if you don't have a razor mouse, I had it set up on, um, on my death adder elite to where a white light would go across my death adder elite whenever I'd click it. And that was my shot animation. <laughs> All right, essence. <clears throat> Okay, guys, we're going to rename our profile uh, Stormtrooper. Hold on. Something froze here. Couldn't, couldn't think of how I wanted to name that. <clears throat> so, so who's all, who's doing the profile with me or is everybody just watching and putting in input? How's your guys' night going tonight? Okay. Uh, let's. Let's get rid of this spectrum cycling layer and let's put on a wave. <clears throat> Am I using a black widow? No, I'm using a huntsman elite. I'm using a huntsman elite keyboard. You're doing it with me. Mine is good. Good to hear. Good to hear. Kobe. Hey, what's up, man? <clears throat> Do 
you're using a black widow elite nice nice back all right guys you're back yo nemesis thank you for the sub thank you for the sub adam lewis uh thanks for the sub, sub. a little behind here <clears throat> mincy you just now subbed thank you for the sub man get that thank you for the sub all right guys let's get going with the uh stormtrooper profile um i'm actually i might use static on this one i don't know if i want the white to change I don't know if I want the white to change, so I think I might use static. Um, yeah, let's go static for all this stuff here. We're gonna start off with the static white. The big package gaming. Thank you for the sub, man. I appreciate that. <clears throat> okay, um, we're gonna go static and we're gonna choose a white color. So six Fs is a hex code. For anybody just hopping in, we're going to be making a stormtrooper design. Stormtrooper. And also, I'm broke, so once get money, we'll join. No worries, man. No worries. It's no pressure. Gavin, what's up, man? Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. <clears throat> I'm so underrated. <laughs> Thanks, man. I appreciate that. I get a lot of comments like that. You guys are way too nice. Way too nice. All right, let's zoom in here on the keyboard. All right, let's take a let's take a peek back at our uh at our idea here. We got to go with something simple. Take a stormtrooper head. <clears throat> okay hero you should have like 1 billion views on the stream you're so underrated <laughs> i appreciate it man uh what do you mean we're not nice enough <laughs> well i don't know there are there are a few bad apples in the crowd but not this crowd my friend got a razor keyboard and i recommend you to him immediately <laughs> i appreciate that man I do. I have a lot of profiles for you guys. There's a lot of people in the Chroma Profiles community that offer a lot of good stuff. So I, I recommend checking out that Discord or, or Reddit channel as well. Sakura, they come in the keyboard. <clears throat> what are those light strips you have? So I do have several different light strips that are showing up here. I think this is what Sakura is talking about. So these are the Razer HDK, the hardware development kit. They're actually not really out to the public anymore. Yo, Sparksy, thank you so much. I appreciate that, man. Thank you so much. Um, these, these HDK, you can't really find them anymore. When I found them, I bought them on Amazon. Uh, these other light strips here. There are different devices that are plugged into my uh, Razer Chroma controller. My crazy Razer Chroma controller inside my case. So, <clears throat> so I got my... Right here is my graphics card backplate that I have. And then this is the graphics card uh, support bracket that I have. Uh, these are my internal hard drives, the T-Force ones. And then uh, number six, I believe, this is, this is my CPU cooler. Um, this is my um, graphics card itself, along with my RAM sticks and my motherboard. And um, actually, number six is both my CPU cooler and my fans. So they're the same. They're on the same light strip. 
Yeah, some overweight nine-year-old will come in here telling you to quit. Meanwhile, he has three subs. Yeah, I've seen that before. All right, guys, let's focus on the keyboard here. Okay, <clears throat> so white background. Let's go with some, let's try to make some storm. I'm going to hold control here, and I'm going to select out the shape of, uh, we're going to try and get the, sh the shape of our stormtrooper eyes. I don't have music this time around guys. Um, I just bought a brand new uh, audio mixer. So I'm trying to get that figured out. So uh, no audio this time around. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to go with this right here and see what this looks like. Let's make this black. So by holding control, you can select all the keys that you want and just kind of deselect some stuff there. So that looks okay. Uh, I think I'm going to see what happens when I... Maybe in the bead background, you could make some light lightning strikes some light lightning strikes that happen every once in a while. Um, maybe I might be able to make that happen. <clears throat> should I make the whole keyboard white or should I try and make the shape of the guy's head? I feel like this is, let me hit save and see what it looks like on my keyboard. I kind of feel like I should make the shape of his head. So let's let's just uh, erase everything there in the middle and let's try and uh, shape out the stormtrooper head here. All right, so we got the shape of our stormtrooper head, um, and let's try to see what it looks like when we add. Ooh, ooh, I don't know how that's gonna look. Hmm. What does this look like? Nah, that's not doing it. It's got to be all white. It's gotta be all white. Hey, hey, can you try out my Chroma profile and rate it? I spent eight hours perfecting it. Which one? Which one did you make? <clears throat> okay, so we're gonna go with all white and I'm gonna go back to, um, I'm gonna go back to try and put the uh, eyes the uh I guess the helmet it's more of a helmet the helmet glasses on here we're gonna have to go with something like this okay <clears throat> um I'm gonna kind of outline the we're gonna throw on a wave here so this is gonna be our base kind of our background for the uh this kind of this is gonna be our background for the stormtrooper design <clears throat> uh lighting designs would be so much nicer if the keys were in a grid pattern oh you could do so much better like shaping and stuff for sure i don't know how easy that would be to type on though no name yet give me a second <laughs> spent eight hours working on it and you didn't even give it a name All right, so this is going to be our base. We're going to throw on a wave pattern and we're going to kind of outline 
um, the helmet, okay, and just kind of throw on a, an outer wave. So um, I'm going to throw on... I'm going to light up this whole left side here, and I'm going to light up... Um, Let's see, these keys right here, so from the uh, forward slash down to the function, this little section here, and then everything on the numpads, everything to the right here. So I'm gonna take all of these, I'm gonna choose this three node pattern right here, and I'm gonna make this, I'm gonna make this white in the middle here. <clears throat> it's kinda like this, except I don't wanna go straight to black, so the outside nodes, I'm going to make um, not black, but I'm going to make them a uh, kind of a dark gray here. Uh, once I have my gray color, I'm going to click this addition symbol and it'll give me my gray here. Click on my last node and I'm going to make that last node gray as well. Um, I don't like the shape that we've made here of the stormtrooper. I'm actually going to desel or I'm going to select this space bar and hit the delete key and uh, remove the effect from that. Why is that? Oh, I gotta go static. I don't like having the white there. I think it kind of messes with it. <laughs> Let's see what this looks like on the keyboard. That actually looks pretty good on the keyboard um, compared to um, what it's looking like on the screen here. I like that a lot. <clears throat> Maybe in the eyes you could make a dark gray wave that goes kind of diagonal. Like in a movie where there is a shine that oh across the sunglasses. You could definitely do that. So yeah, let's do that actually. So on our wave layer here, I'm gonna select all of the eye parts. Just like that so we're on our wave select the eye portion click on our color drop down we're going to choose a three node wave right here and we're going to pinch in these outside nodes really close um and i'm just gonna, i'm going to make it a little bit thicker here this inside node i'm going to make white and I'm going to hit the addition symbol to make it a little bit thicker. There we go. Now he's kind of got it going on. So I'm going to, I'm going to call it there actually with, uh, <clears throat> with these outside nodes, I'm going to make those invisible. Make those invisible. And I'm going to add a pause though. So like every five seconds, every five seconds, it'll, it'll wipe. Maybe change my angle up to somewhere up here to the right. That looks good. Wait, what is that going to look like? Let's see. Keyboard cam. I know, Gavin. I need, I have a camera. I just, I'm waiting on a mount. I need to get a mount. Yeah, keyboard cam is definitely a good idea. I do have a spare camera. Um, waiting on a mount. I don't like the way this angle makes this look, so I'm going to go back to 90 degrees here. That makes it look really weird. <laughs> All right. That's looking pretty good. That is looking pretty good. What else can we add to this? What else can we add to this that is Stormtrooper related? Squills, thanks for the sub, man. I appreciate that. I guess I shouldn't say man. It could be anybody. Squills, thank you for the sub. Thank you for the sub. Ooh, we could also add a color change too, like color, an optional color, make it a red Stormtrooper. Or maybe do gold 
for R2-D2. Okay. I kind of like this, uh, this lighted background for maybe an audio, audio meter. Do you like the orange, orange eyeballs? Orange eyeballs for the audio meter. <clears throat> okay. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and add, I'm going to go ahead and add on a ripple effect for our lasers. I don't know how you would do this, but in my mind, I'm picturing like a flash of red that kind of looks like a shot from a blaster. Yes. Yes. That's what we're going to do right now. So we're going to do the blaster. So we're going to add a ripple effect. I'm going to rename this ripple effect layer to blaster blasters. All right. So the way we're going to do this is we're going to select all of our keys on our keyboards. Okay. Select all your keys, click on your color drop down, and we are going to choose this single color pattern here. All right. Just choose a single color pattern here. I'm going to make a green for one of my uh, horizontal lines and I'm going to do a red. And I'm going to do a red. <clears throat> Looks like maybe, maybe make it switch between red and white for an audio meter. Do a red and white. Maybe. Might be able to, to do that. Are you doing more than one profile in the stream? No, I'm going to try and limit the streams to just one profile. Um, I don't want to get burned out on it. I don't, I don't think I will, but I don't want to get burned out on it. And I also don't want you guys to get burned out on it. So, um, I think once a week I'm going to jump in here. Um, you know, we're going to make a profile, you know, I'm thinking about streaming on Sundays instead of on Mondays and make it way earlier because I think there's a lot of people that can't make my stream because I, um, this is the soonest I can do it. I live on the West coast and, uh, and I wait till my kids are in bed before I start streaming. So, um, it, it ends up being way too late for a lot of you guys. Oh, um, on our ripple. Okay. So we're working on our ripple here. I'm going to double click to select all of our stuff and I'm going to choose the playback needs to be on selected keys and it needs to end after one. Okay. Just like that. Keep the width at 300. Um, you can mess around this with the speed if you want. I'm going to keep it here. So the way we're going to do this to make uh, horizontal lines is we're going to hold control and we are going to deselect let me go back here. So we have everything selected. I'm holding control and I'm going to select the bottom row. I'm just going to take that out of the equation. So with all of our above layers here, we're going to click on the color drop down, click on our node, and we're going to change this last digit to a one. That makes these keys different from that bottom row. Same thing. Hold control, deselect the bottom line. Click on our color drop down. We're going to change this last digit by one digit again. So from one to two. And we're just going to do the same thing going up. Deselect the bottom row. Click on our color drop down. Change the last digit from a two to a three. And we're going to do that all the way up. Changing the last digit to a four. Selecting this line. Changing the last digit to a five. <clears throat> so by making each line unique, we're able to uh, we're able to get horizontal ripple lines. So, so here you can see I've got horizontal ripple lines in green. Uh oh, I pressed F five. So. Horizontal lines and ripples. What's your favorite razor product I have? 
I actually, my favorite razor product I have, oof, that's a tough question. I don't think I've ever been asked that question before. Um, I would say my favorite razor product that I have is my razor Huntsman V2 analog. I just really like the way it feels and it's so comfortable. I just don't use it primarily. Um, it is a much nicer keyboard in my opinion than the Huntsman elite that I'm using. But the reason I'm using a Huntsman elite is because the Huntsman elite is most compatible with everybody's keyboard. So I start on the Huntsman Elite first, and then I will uh, I adapt the lighting to the V2 analog and the Mini. I am going to make the ripples red as well. It's going to be red and green, kind of like they're fighting. So um, here the ripples are green. All right. So we're going to make every other line red. So let's select the second row. Um, we can actually double click on tab here. It'll select that line, double click on escape. It'll select these three rows. All right. So we got these three rows selected. We're going to click on our color drop down. We're going to choose this single pattern here again, and we're going to make it red. But we have to do the same thing we did before. Uh, hold control, deselect this row here that we have selected. Go in and change the node by one digit. So change your hex code by a digit. Same thing, hold control, deselect this row. And we can go into our color drop down, change the hex code by one digit again, and hit save. <clears throat> I have the same mouse and mouse pad as Unreal Hero. Nice, dude. Yeah, the Basilisk Ultimate is phenomenal mouse. Phenomenal. I love this mouse. This thing is amazing. Okay, so now that we've done all that, we should have red and green horizontal lines. And we do. So that's, that's a pretty cool effect. What kind of, I feel like there should be a reactive. Um, I feel like there should be a reactive here. Is red and green too much like Christmas? Should it be red only? Yeah, it is kind of like Christmas, isn't it? Christmas trooper, right? Yeah, that's right. You think it should be either red or dark red? We could try that. So I'm going to, I'm going to select all my green rows here. I'm going to change them to a, a darker red. Let's make it red, drag that dark. I'm going to click the addition sign here so I can add this red. <laughs> Actually, you don't need to do that. So we have red here. Um, I'm going to hold control, deselect nothing. I'm going to actually click off of that and select it again. Okay, hold control, deselect your bottom row, change your hex code by a digit. Sometimes this does this where it bugs. See how I can't select anything? So when that happens, what you have to do is like go to a different layer. So select your wave layer and go back to blasters. And then you can do it again. Hold control, deselect your row. This time you should be able to have your adjustments. Change your hex code by one digit. Same thing, deselect this row. And it's giving me the bug again here. So once again, wave, go back to blasters. You got to do some, uh, <clears throat> you got to do a lot of troubleshooting sometimes. I think it should be either red or black or red and black. Okay. And it's ready. What's, oh, what's ready. Hero, do you smoke or do any drugs? No, I don't. Uh, I know it's a weird question. I don't, 
and am way too young too anyway. Uh, and I'd no, I've never smoked or done any drugs in my life, to be honest with you, ever. I'm clean, clean as a whistle. Yeah, don't do drugs, kids. Should I send it to you on Discord? Oh, your your profile? Yeah, you can send it. There's a profile share channel on my Discord. You can um, you can go and throw it in there. Yeah, it is looking sick. All right, so we could also um, we could also add some kind of uh, yellow to it. I feel like this needs a little bit of yellow. Kind of like the Star Wars. Um, I'm a good man. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. Spy kills. Thank you so much. I appreciate that, man. Homer. What do you mean, Homer? Um, okay, so where are we at here? Okay, oh, yeah, these are the same. Okay, let me deselect this bottom row and change the hex code by change it from a one to a two. And we should be good now with the horizontal lines. We should have a bright red and a, a dark red. That does actually look a lot better. We'll go with that. Um, should we do yellow in the goggles? for an audio meter. What do you guys think about doing a yellow? What do you guys think about doing a yellow? Can I put my profile in the Discord? You guys can put your profile in the profile share channel. What what kind of what's it called, lizard? I'm willing to check out your guys' profiles if you guys have them. I'm willing to check them out. If you guys want to put them in the profile share at the end of the stream, I'll check them out. <clears throat> Yellow for audio meter, 100%. I agree. All right, so we're done with the ripple effect layer. I do want to add one thing for a reactive. We're going to put the reactive on the very top. So with our reactive, we're going to just select all of our keys and do white. Make a white reactive layer. And medium's fine. Why is that not changing? Okay. Yeah, that looks good. I feel like something should be going on. Outside of just the white. This is what we're going to do. We're going to, if you guys have the out, the outer lighting. You, it's called USA flag. Kinda <laughs> USA flag. Kinda. <laughs> That's a nice name. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, USA flag, kinda, you know, kinda. Like it. Okay, we're gonna throw on an audio meter. Okay, so with this audio meter, um, I'm gonna select the um, the eye portion of our stormtrooper helmet, and I'm gonna select the colors, and we're gonna fade from black. We're gonna choose this two-node pattern here. We're gonna fade from black to yellow. I think yellow will look good. 
I think yellow will look good. So I'm going to play some music, but I don't think you guys are actually going to hear it. Um, we'll see. I don't see anything what's going on. Uh, can you guys hear that music? You guys can hear it? Maybe it's maybe it's being played through my microphone. Is it loud? Tell me if that's loud. So it's actually not reacting at all. Oh, uh, yeah, it's not going to react because So you guys can hear it. Okay. Yeah, I don't have Spotify set up as my default. So the way audio meter works, guys, if you guys um if you guys are not getting like your audio meter to react is if your source right now, my Spotify music does not play on my default source. So my default source is my go XLR mini because you guys should be able to hear it now. Should be able to hear it now. But if, if, um, if your music source isn't playing to your default playback device, you're not going to see any, anything happen on your Razer devices. So right now it, it is not, um, I can probably change that though. So I don't know. Now, if I change it, it's going to blow your guys' eardrums out. I'm pretty sure. Let's not do that. I'm not going to do that to you guys. <clears throat> I may be able to mute. Hold on. Let me mute. Nah, I can't do it right now, guys. Sorry. I'll play a little bit of music. Just let me know if it's too loud. There should be a black reactive on white and white reactive on black. I see where your head's at. It's not a bad idea. Not a bad idea, actually. Let's go back and do that. So we have white reactive. Okay. So I'm going to hold control, deselect the eyes. We'll keep the white on the eyes. So with the white part selected, click our color drop down. 00001. Save. <clears throat> All right. All right, done. We are tough enough. <laughs> I don't have a magma profile. I do have a, an embers profile. Uh, 
Um, I think what I'm going to do here um, with the, my wave, I'm going to go back to my wave layer and I'm going to make my outer lighting um, do something a little bit more interesting. Uh, I'm going to do this three node pattern here. I'm going to make it white and black. I'm going to choose this five node pattern actually. Drag that in. Make this white. We're going to add to double that. Leave that black there. I'm going to delete this last node. Make this last node right here white. Select this black node right here. Hit the addition symbol. There we go. So we have a, like a little bit of a pattern going. I'm going to select off of that and split it. Is that too busy? Maybe I should slow it down. That looks good. I'm going to go with speed three. You think the, the ripple will be a bit much with the red? It kind of is a bit much with the red. Oh, what we can do? What we can also do, if we go to the blasters, that's our ripple effect. Although it's kind of going to mess with everything. Ah, screw it. Um, what we can do is we're going to select this, click on our color drop down, hit the addition symbol, slide our new node all the way over here, and just separate that from the first node by just a little tiny gap, okay? So you got two nodes that are all the way slammed over to the left. This, this node right here on the right, make that invisible. So you have a little tiny sliver of red. Okay, I'll show you what this looks like. So it has a red, it has a red reactive, but it doesn't go very far. I hate it. I'm not going to lie. I hate it. I'm going to delete that and forget I did anything. <laughs> Do you like the Huntsman Elite or Analog V2? Analog V2 is better in my opinion. The only thing that kind of sucks is I, I'm, I'm a controller gamer for some games. Some games I play uh, keyboard and mouse, but for like competitive games like Call of Duty, um, I play on a controller. And the only thing bad about the V2 Analog is it actually is read as a joystick. The uh, WASD is red as a joystick. So when you plug in the V2 analog, I have a problem with my controller not working because the keyboard tries to take priority over my controller. That's the only issue I have with it. How did I make my logo? I just messed around with uh, ideas in Photoshop. I made it myself. All right, guys, so we got the, uh, is, how's the music? Is it too loud? Or is it not playing? I feel like for it to start playing it uh, I think it cuts out you guys we're gonna we're not gonna be able to do the music right now we're not gonna be able to do the music right now we'll well I'll try and get it going for the next stream okay so yeah I really do want to test I really do want to test uh 
I'm gonna test my audio. I'm gonna test the audio meter. I gotta see what it looks like. Told you it was gonna be loud. Can you guys hear me? Yeah, that'll work. Actually, this works pretty good. Okay, yeah, that might be a bit too much. I think the yellow is too dark or too light. Sorry, guys, I didn't mean to blow your eardrums out there. Can you show our profiles in the profile share channel soon? Yeah, I will. <clears throat> I'm going to make the yellow on the audio meter a little bit darker. I think that's all we're going to be able to do with this uh, Stormtrooper design. Can you show our profiles in the profile share channel soon? Yeah. You the emoji. It's okay. I use emojis all the time. Yeah, it does look like he's wearing some bling glasses. We could also, if you really wanted, you could add fire in there too. We could make a fire option. So if we add a fire layer, we can make, you can make the eyes fire. The hot will make yellow, cold will make orange. So you could add fire in there. And if you don't like the fire, you can just hit this eye symbol to turn it off. I don't know if I really like the shape of the helmet here. I'm gonna go back to this wave. I'm gonna see what this looks like when I deselect these. Hmm. <clears throat> that fire actually looks really cool. It's kind of hard to tell what it is though on your keyboard. I'm going to re uh reselect these cuz it it look better that way. <laughs> Looks kind of like a ghost too. Yeah, it kind of does. I gotta uncheck that fire. It's a bit too much for me. <clears throat> so I assume my mic is still good. Is the, can you guys hear the music? No. Oh well. All right, guys. Stormtrooper design. Not my favorite. I'm not gonna lie, but I'm not sure what else you can what else you can do with it. Not bad, not bad. Not the worst one. I 
All right, that's going to do it for the Stormtrooper design. So we got a uh, we got a ripple effect going on. Got a reactive. You know what? I'm going to take the reactive. I'm going to take away the white and black. I'm going to make it I'm going to make it yellow. I feel like that'll look better. So you got a yellow reactive but with the red ripples. That looks a lot better. That looks a lot better. We're going to go with that. <laughs> Profile share. I know, man. You're all about it. You're all about it. All right, guys. <clears throat> so this is going to do it for this profile. I'm going to export this as my regular profile, and then I have to adapt the mini and the V2. I'm going to throw this in uh, Discord real quick for you guys. All right. In the live channel on my Discord server, there will be this profile. You'll be able to download this Stormtrooper profile. So I have two profiles to check out. I got a US flag kinda. <laughs> and I got spoiler magma pulse from Mincy. Mince mince mincify. I like Mincy better, but mincify. Okay, I downloaded them, but let me adapt this to my other T keyboards real quick. And then I'll, uh, and then I'll do that. Boomer, hey, welcome to the stream. Sorry, I'm a little bit behind. You've been here for a few minutes already, but... Welcome to the stream, man. Eat foil. Do you watch Demon Slayer? No, no, I've never heard of it, to be honest with you. Okay, let's uh let's adapt our other keyboards here. Shouldn't take me too long on this. So if you guys have the V2 analog or the Huntsman Mini. Um, I'm going to be making your guys' profile here in just a second. What is Demon Slayer? What's that about? Am I missing out? Hero, why is it called a profile? I don't know. It's always called it a Razor Chroma profile or Razor chroma design I think um 
Hold on a second. Make these a little bit different and go from a C to a D. I think it actually says profile when you go to select it up here, but just give me a second and I'll uh, I'll confirm that. So if you go to select it, let's see. I guess it's not. It's more of a razor chroma effect. You think it's anime? I can confirm. Confirm. I can't spell. <laughs> confirm. 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 It's all good. I can't either. I need a good red, white, blue effect for my firefly. You need a good red, white, blue effect. For your firefly? I mean, you can make it pretty simple. I can make you a cool one right after this. Give me a second. I can do it in like one minute. Ah, uh, two minutes probably. Right now I have a wheel on there. A wheel is pretty good. There's not much you can do with a firefly. I feel like a, a wheel is pretty decent. What's wrong with the wheel? Your radar effect is pretty sick. Yeah, I like the radar one. That's one of my favorite ones to look at for sure. What about a yellow orange fade with white spots on it? What do you mean? Starlight should be good for the spots. Yeah. You guys are talking about a different profile. Yeah, that's all good. Um, I mean, you can put some stuff on there that that is pretty. You can put some stuff on there that's pretty nifty. All right, let me, let's add the blasters. This is gonna be the tough part because I gotta come up with a lot of different numbers here. Okay, so we're gonna change, we're gonna change our second digit from a C to a B. I'm just recoloring um, this profile, adapting them to the V2 in Mini. Who are your favorite artists? The Hero and Mini, or the V2 and Mini, and then uh, and then I'll have these published for you guys on every compatibility. And then I'm gonna check out a couple of your guys' profiles. My favorite artists for music. Ooh, that's getting personal. I feel like a lot of you guys would leave my channel. <clears throat> it, I don't know, like music, 
I don't really have a favorite. I kind of like I kind of like all music. When I when I work out and when I um Yeah, I really like to listen to Disturbed, actually. I like Disturbed a lot. Disturbs my workout music. Oh, you play guitar? Nice, dude. That's awesome. That is awesome. Yeah, I love Disturbed too. <laughs> My favorite song is Vengeful One. Um, I think my favorite song is Animal. Animal is a good one. You guys look up Disturbed Animal. I can't play it on here, otherwise they'll demonetize me, but that's a good song. What about you guys? What's your favorites? Ah, oh, don't do this to me. The media keys are so helpful. Yeah, I I agree. I I found them really helpful for uh, for streaming for sure. Five finger death punch, disturbed, shine down, and God smack. Yeah, those are all good, man. We have we have similar taste. Why is it doing this to me? There we go. Ugh. All right, this is what I got to do. Never found that bug before. I've never found it to where it never comes up. So I got to paste in the effect in there. Manually do it. That's kind of annoying. Okay. Oh, you know what? I need to go back to my static layer and deselect my glasses, my goggles on the helmet. The mini is going to be a tough one. That'll work. That'll work right there. My favorite Razer keyboard, it's the analog V2. Yep. Thanks, Lizard. 
Mine is some kind of Razor Huntsman, like regular or mini or elite or TE, all those. It depends really like <sighs> Razor's got a lot of good ones and it really just depends on your purpose on like what the purpose is. If you're using it for competitive gaming, you got to have the numpads too much. If you're using it for competitive gaming, you got to go with the, the mini or the tournament edition. It's just, it gets in the way. It really depends on your purpose. I also really like to type on the Huntsman Mini. I just really like the way it feels. Everyone does forget about the TE. And I actually don't have uh, a tournament edition. And I really want one so that I can have, um, you know, good uh, profile compatibility for you guys. I really want to get one just so I can, uh, just so, cause there's some profiles that don't, they don't transfer very well to a tournament edition. And I, I, uh, I want to be able to do that for you guys. I'm just making sure that my, uh, yeah. Okay. That's all working. All right, we're almost done here. Optional fire if you guys want it, but I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it unchecked. If you guys want the fire eyes and your stormtrooper. If you want the fire eyes, you got to come into this effect layer and unhide the fire layer and you guys will have fire for the eyes here's what that looks like and i'm gonna actually make these a little bit different for each keyboard that way it doesn't skew the appearance. There you go. All right, so now it looks the same on every keyboard. All right, so this is everything. All right, there's the Stormtrooper Razor Chroma profile made by yours truly. Stormtrooper. Um, also COD, but rarely Minecraft. I play a lot of Rocket League. All right, guys. Hey, I want to hear. I'm going to check out some of your guys' user profiles. I'm going to show you guys them. I'm going to critique them. I'm going to I'm gonna take a peek at them. But also, if you guys have any really good ideas for what I should make next week, or maybe make a video on this week, or maybe, um, you know, just throw some ideas at me, and um, and we'll see where it goes from there oh i gotta add the wave on the other i just realized i have to add the wave let me add this wave on the glasses here that last profile that i just exported will need to be saved over okay there we go Okay, this is gonna go this is gonna be uploaded on the uh on the Discord channel.
All right, guys, the moment you've all been waiting for. I get to critique you guys. This should be good. <clears throat> all right, first one. USA flag, kinda. USA flag, kinda. <laughs> I like the name, that's awesome. Kind of a USA flag. And this is going to be saved as USA Dream. USA Dream. Let's check it out. Let's check out the USA Dream. I'm scared to look. I wish I could send my profile in, but I'm on my phone. Yeah, it's all good, man. No worries. Okay. USA Dream. Oh, that's actually pretty dope. That's actually pretty dope. I like that a lot. Did you, uh, did you maybe use this in the, uh, <clears throat> in the profile of the month? Right now, the profile of the month competition, um, uh, is red versus blue. So I feel like this would be a reasonable submission. Let's see. So you got two fire layers, a starlight and a wave. So your first fire layer. Okay. So you have hot, cold. Okay. Here you have hot, cold. So it's gray. Okay. Are your grays the same color here? You're hot and cold for your middle. Your grays are the same color. Is that intentional? It's fine. These are actually two separate fire layers here. That's pretty cool looking though. No, you didn't. I should. You should submit it. You would get some votes, I bet. So you have fire, starlight, and a wave. No, uh, no kind of reactive or anything fancy with pressing it. You should experiment into that a little bit more. You're kind of new. This is pretty good. You know, it's not bad. That's actually really uh, kind of a unique starlight. I don't, I usually do my starlights as one color, but yeah, this is a good idea for a starlight because your, your one starlight goes through three colors. I need to start doing that more. That's a good idea. Your wave, you don't have your wave set up for anything. It's set up on my dock, my mouse dock. Not bad, you know, it's, 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 it's not bad for a beginner. You could have done more with it. You could have added an audio meter, maybe a, a ripple or a reactive on there and made it, made it look pretty good. You, do your cherry blossom one? Oh yeah, I didn't get a chance to look at it. <laughs> I don't know if I want to embarrass you like that. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> see beginner, you should see mine. Looks like France. <laughs> yeah. Looks like France. You want to see a next level USA profile. If you look at my Memorial Day one. <clears throat> I don't know if you guys have had a chance to, uh, I don't know if you've had a chance to look at my Memorial Day profile, but this is actually a really, really unique profile. Okay. So this is a Memorial Day profile design and it goes, uh, it goes green and brown for like uh, military, right? And then it goes to a U.S. flag. But when it goes to green and brown, it actually spells out in white white lights. It spells out, we remember. So when it goes green and brown, you can see the white lights spell out, we remember. We remember. 
And then it goes back to the flag. This is next level right here. That takes a while to make. That takes a long time. All right, let's check out our other profile here. All right, this one is from Mincy. It's Magma Pulse. Magma Pulse. God tier level is damn cool. Thanks, David. Yeah, appreciate that. That hidden text though, I know. You gotta you gotta you gotta go above and beyond. Put some time into it. Alright, here we go. Magma pulse. Mincify. I need to adapt this to all my devices. Mincify Magma Pulse. All right, this is the last one I'm going to check out and then I'm going to hop off of here. Okay. Let me focus in on the keyboard here. I like the I like the gradient. How it goes from black to red. That's really good. This is a, an, a very appealing right off the bat. I got to I got to hand it to you there. Very appealing. Okay, so you have... The way you did this is you did a wave with a zero speed. I like it. That's smart. Very smart. So when you do this, do you have to stop it at the right spot? Or can you just... Can you move it to zero here? Oh no, it will, it will correct. Interesting, interesting. Okay, and then you got a ripple effect on there. Really busy, in my opinion. I can't say I'm in love with the ripple effect. It's a little too busy for me. I know other people. Hey, Step Cut, what's up, man? Welcome, welcome to the stream. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Essence, we, I'll look at yours again real quick. If you guys were at the last stream, um, at the end of my last stream, I was going to look at um, Essence's Cherry Blossom design. I did not because for some reason it was having an issue downloading it. So we're going to check that out today too. You think next Monday what? I think we're not going to do Monday. Hey guys, next week, I think I'm going to stream on Sunday. We're going to stream on Sunday next week during the day. A little bit earlier in the day and see if we can't get some, uh, some more people in on the stream. Get some more ideas flowing. Okay, so <clears throat> the ripple... I, what I would do is not 50. That, whoa, that's crazy. That's, that's impressively high. What's this look like? Let me see. Honestly, that looks so much better in my opinion. This is just my opinion, but I honestly think you should go a little bit lower. Um, I also think that you should, I suggest this with anybody is that if you guys are making a, if you guys have a razor mouse, your mouse sets off your ripple effect. I find that to be kind of annoying myself. Change your start to on selected keys. Then you got a starlight. Over the black area. This is a really nice appealing profile. I am I like it. I'm I enjoy it for sure. Well done. I'm not sure what more you could do. 
to make it like really really nice maybe add a you could add a um an audio meter that kind of messes with maybe the red and the black where that divide is that might be kind of cool but that might be kind of um uh, might be kind of time consuming too hey man did you did you did stormtrooper i did step cut you just missed the stormtrooper stream but i'll show you what that looks like so we just finished it stormtrooper it's in you can go download it it's in my discord server my live channel it looks like this i would turn the fire and the audio meter off but this is stormtrooper okay and last but not least we're gonna check out this is cherry blossom made by vc essence okay vc essence cherry blossom <clears throat> you could turn the black into a dark dark gray so you can see your keys yeah, you could. You could if you wanted to. But the thing about like any kind of white, so this is VC essence. The thing about any kind of white is that it kind of as soon as you raise it to the point where you can see it, it it really kind of blends all the other whites together. It's kind of hard to separate white lights. So VC Essence Cherry Blossom. He's got a white static. He's got a red starlight on and a reactive, a red reactive. Yep, I would say uh <laughs> I mean it's it's not bad, but it's pretty basic. We went in in deep. So this is a uh, VC Essence Cherry Blossom. Unreal Hero Cherry Blossom. A little bit of a difference there. We made a we made a banger banger profile last week, guys. I got to say this one is epic. Banger profile last week. Real solid. Here looks like crap. <laughs> well, I mean, to be fair, I have a lot more experience with the program. Don't beat yourself up. Don't beat yourself up too much. I was pretty pretty satisfied with this one last week. Okay. All right, guys. I think that is going to do it for the stream. If you guys like the Stormtrooper design that we made tonight, that is going to be available there. You can go to the description. Uh, there's a link to my Discord channel in the live channel. Um, under my server so um, you guys can have the for free um, also um, please join my discord um, if you haven't there's a lot of stuff in there um, you can share profiles I'd be happy to check out your guys's profiles um, and there's um, links to my website and you guys can get all my profiles there as well but <clears throat> you like my lightning 2.0 thank you so much uh, but that is going to do it for this stream, guys. I hope you guys liked it. We're going to stream on Sunday this week. So this upcoming Sunday, I'm going to switch it to Sunday instead of Monday. 
uh, and try to do a stream a little bit earlier in the day for you guys. Um, so don't miss out on that stream. Put it in your calendar. Set a reminder. Sunday night. Uh, you guys, if you guys haven't already, if you guys like the stream, please hit that thumbs up button. I'd really appreciate it. It will help me out a ton. Uh, make sure you guys put on your notifications so you guys don't miss out on future streams. And I'm going to be uploading some videos um, here soon as well. Um, also, if you guys like making profiles, I know some of you do. I've checked out some of you guys' profiles already. If you guys want to enter in the profile of the month competition, uh, you guys can go to the Razor Chroma Profiles Discord channel and you can see how to enter and win there. So don't forget to do that. But that's going to do it for me, gentlemen and ladies. Um, I will see you guys on Sunday. You guys take it easy.